walking around X Live, and who shall I meet but the living freaking legend himself? Gutex. Oh no! It's Gutex. That's right, That's right Jason. The like, cross counter. Be careful where you're watching. I'll just like cut you off and be like, "Yo, I haven't seen you in like ten years." Hey guys, we're about to hit the road again, and the next trip is to Los Angeles, going back to Cali uh, for X Live, which is a conference where I'm going to be speaking on a panel about esports. Back to the airport, Southwest Airlines, back to sunny California. Come on along. Made it here to LA, uh, flight was easy peasy, other than the fact that I've got some sinus stuff going on. But it's great to be back in LA, even if we're just uh, doing the, the conference for one day. Looking forward to the conference, and I will get as much uh, footage as we can and go from there. So as luck would have it, uh, my sinus headache actually turned into a full-blown cold, but I feel like junk, so I'm sitting, eating dinner alone, and uh, try to get a good night's sleep, and get some footage of the uh, panel tomorrow. <clears throat> Hopefully, I don't sound like junk, because I feel like junk. Being sick's not fun. Well, I woke up sick as a dog. But got to man up and uh, get some medicine and get over to the conference. So if you watch my answers today, and I'm, I'm really discombobulated and, uh, and not making sense, now you know why. Got to man up. Get to work. First visitor for the vlog this time, we got Matt from Ghost Gaming. What's going on, Matt? So you're relatively new to uh, Ghost Gaming. Talk to me about what's going on. So uh, PUBG team, uh, they, they won our first uh, LAN championship at PGL. I actually uh, offered you that same team. <laughs> <laughs> We're not in PUBG yet. Uh, Good you, game, you, you had the chance. Good game. Uh, looking at uh, a few new games. Uh, might even get into Fortnite soon. Leaked. <laughs> Heard it here first. Well, thanks very much for joining yeah. us, Matt. Keep up the good work over the coast. Thanks, Jason. We got our wedding chapel. Small panel today, my friends. Small panel. So the panel went pretty well. Uh, we had a lot of fun talking about different things and uh, esports and building a team and growing a team. Esports 3.0 and better player care. So it was great. It was a small panel, but there's a lot of really cool people here. I hope to grab a couple more for the vlog and uh, sit in on some panels myself. I'm managing to keep my head cold at bay. Thank you, Dayquil, you rock. And uh, stay tuned, we'll see who else I can grab uh, for the vlog before I leave here. Legend, man, a lot of people don't remember this, but we did a collaboration back in the day. It was Complexity Cross Counter. Oh yeah, we, were we had the sports. bad we ass fighting game community team. Ever. We had it's Champ, Kutex, Mike Ross, Combo Fiend. Like, we kicked everybody's ass. It's yeah, true. You guys went esports first. Yeah, so we maybe got we in, shouldn't air this. We got in and we got out. <laughs> <laughs> and now, here we are again. And we got David over here. That's right. Panda Global. So we're hanging out, doing the esports uh, you know, conference thing. So Gutex has gone full esports if he's here. <laughs> David, David, David's got the esports credentials, and I, I just, the, uh, I just, my way in. David was walking more and I, I, I went behind him. You like came that. in behind David? Yeah. Awesome, man. Well, it's really great to see you guys. And, uh, you know, you and I go way back, brother. You know it, man. It's always good to see you. Small world and a long life. That's it. Take care. Ran into the man behind E League, behind IMG's esports efforts, now behind. Can we talk about it yet? Yeah, we can talk about it. What's the name of the company? Foundry 4. Foundry 4. Forging value in esports. Forging, oh, I like that. I like that. So what can you share with the uh, the vlog world about Foundry 4? Trailblaze some new 
new areas in esports provide some value. I think uh, we're going to get ahead of the game as usual. You know, I like to to take a big leap. Mm -hmm. We never yeah. take little steps, so it's yeah. another big leap in the space. That's true. For what uh, what panel are you on? I don't think it's a panel. It's a fireside chat, which is going to be fireside chat. Kind of dangerous in LA. Yeah, I don't. In this, in this, crazy about uh, that. But idea. yeah, hopefully, fireside you know, chat. I don't know if they have door flame logs or what's going on, but um, <laughs> this place is old. Too. I think what it is is I sit there and, and basically sort of give opinions on esports and, and talk about where it goes, which is probably one of the only things I can do in my life well. But you know what? It's been a, it's been a lot of fun getting to meet with a lot of the the pro sports teams, as you know. You know, I think getting to meet with a lot of them and, and getting to provide extra information so they're educated because. The last thing we want is, are these investors to come back and say, well, it's, it's not what we thought it was or it's a bubble. It's not a bubble, right? You just got to make good investments. That's all. Yep. Heard it here first. Complexity POV, the famous Tumba Sherman is bringing more pro sports teams in esports. We'll leave it there. Peace out. So we ran into Nate. Hi. Old. Hi, guys. I've been seeing Nate at all the things. It's amazing to see you. I'm so Great excited you, about your successes. Your growth, Thank you. your the family move in. You're like yeah, on this whole crazy. new evolution of, <laughs> of, of where you're taking your brand and your team. You're too everything. kind, man. Thank you so much. Yeah. Let's talk about Ult. What's going on with Ult out here in LA? You got okay. the gear, you got a studio. Talk yes. to us quick. So we have 22,000 square feet studio where we make Holy content, crap. shows. That's huge. And it's a design space too where I get to design products for esports lifestyle. And if you go to a Zoomies in any store in any mall across North America, you can buy old products. That's amazing. So it's helping define an, a new category. So your sons, my kids, they'll be able to go to a, the mall yeah. and buy cool esports lifestyle stuff that looks like what the streetwear brands are okay. and the cool modern kind of design brands are. And it's for us. It's for people who love video games and love you know, sharing their passion for competitive uh, esports. I dig it. So what's next for all? What's your next project? We're gonna go into some new categories for footwear and really high-end premium backpacks and travel bags. And we're gonna be starting to work with even bigger and bigger teams, hopefully one day work with you. Hey, but we'll hey, we keep, we keep uh, expanding our reach into other parts of the world, like out into Korea, out into Europe, and into different types of tier one games. Awesome. Yeah. Good stuff, man. Well, yeah. best wishes yeah. to everyone over at all. And thanks a lot for saying hello to Complexity POV. Yeah, awesome. Appreciate it, man. Thanks. Peace. Well, friends, that's a wrap for this trip. Managed to survive the X Live conference sick as a dog. Always love being in LA. Always love seeing good people and great friends at these things. Uh, but it's time to go home. <laughs> Let's go home. Thanks very much for watching. We really appreciate it. Please consider leaving us a comment. Tell us what you think. A like, subscribe, would all be great. We'll see you on the next episode.